Welcome back to my channel for an absolute freaking doozy guys this is an absolute doozy and straight away I'm going to thank the fantastic the wonderful Lady Decade for this one again guys because I didn't know this was in existence until then um Josh did and he's going to be joining me on this video in a little bit so yeah if you've seen Lady Decade's video uh, recent video guys you will know what i'm talking about and if you haven't you need to go over to her channel and check it out guys because this is freaking awesome now way back in the day guys obviously the n64 had mario 64 that gorgeous flipping game guys that changed gaming forever it really did oh, it was just absolutely awesome now diehard fans of that game dearly wanted Nintendo to make a sequel guys um but they never did did they they never ever did now another game that's a hell of a lot more recent guys is also huge it is absolutely fantastic it is Mario Odyssey of course now can you imagine if you combined the two together and made a game so you got a you know Mario 64 elements and then you've got the Mario Odyssey elements as well. Couldn't that possibly be the sequel everybody's been wanting, guys? Well, the thing is, it's been left to the flipping fans again, guys. The diehard fans and the uh, <laughs> the modders, guys. Um, and this fantastic guy has made this brilliant, brilliant game, guys. And I'm shitting you not. It is literally super mario <laughs> super mario odyssey 64 guys i'm shitting you not this is fantastic if you didn't know about this already which i'm sure a hell of a lot of you did already this is incredible absolutely incredible as you are about to see now what i've done is guys i've got josh to play this because there's two games that josh is totally in love with always has been with mario 64 he adores it. He's done lots of videos with me in the past over Mario 64, all sorts of ROM hacks and God knows what else. And he adores Mario Odyssey. He has beaten it left, right and centre and done all the bloody bits and bobs you ever possibly need. So I want him to experience this, guys, because like I said, I crap you not. This is Mario Odyssey, Mario 64, squished together and how it would look on the N64, guys. So yeah, that is the very important thing here. It's like the degraded Mario Odyssey and made it into an N64 game, guys. Now, for the purposes of this video, I'm gonna be using an N64 emulator, which is Super 16, which is a fantastic emulator uh, out there, guys, on Android. And, Josh will be using a PS4 controller as the controls. So, yeah, it's going to be very interesting to see this, guys, because, it's you know, oh, I've already seen it. I've already uh, had a quick, you know, mess about with it. Um, in the video, at the time of recording that, I hadn't. I hadn't touched it at all, and neither had Josh. So this is the first experience, really, for both of us in this video. But since making the video, guys, I have had a go, and it is absolutely just... I can't even begin to uh, tell you how fantastic this is. So the best thing to do, guys, is to show you, isn't it? Right, are you ready for this, guys? Because this is freaking awesome. Oh, my God. Would you have ever believed it? <sighs> Super Mario Odyssey 64. What it would have looked like if it had been on the N64, guys. Right back in a sec. Right, here we go, guys. As, uh, as I said earlier, 
Josh's first experience of this ROM hack, or a hack full stop mostly. Mm-hmm. But it's Mario 64 mixed with Mario Odyssey. Let's see what you think of it, Josh, as you're such a big fan of both of them. Yeah, Mario, <clears throat> Mario Odyssey is one of my favourites. Mm. How do you throw the hat? Hmm. Mm, hopefully I'll figure it out. Catch up to Bowser's ship. Oh, it's like in the intro to Mario Odyssey when uh, Bowser is on the ship. Yep. Can't look here. Obviously, as I said earlier, thank you, Lady Decade, for this one. For introducing me to it. These accessories can walk you to close kingdoms. Use the L button to throw a hat at it. The L button. Oh, yeah. Uh, hey, there you go. Now you know how to throw your hat. Mm hmm. I'm not very good at it. This is quite cool though. Yeah, isn't it? How cool does that look? Mm -hmm. cool. Wait, he just like loses all his speed when he throws his hat. That's weird. Yeah. Oh, you can kick him. Wait, <laughs> look at this. If you hold him there and run up to him, look. You can kick, kick him. him. Yeah, yeah. Because normally in the original, you just run up to him and you just automatically bounce off his head. Yeah. Oh, he went through the box. Anyway. Oh, that messed up. I suppose it's going to have some limitations somewhere, isn't it? Yeah, whoa, you can do the thingy from Mario Sunshine. Wait, how do you do it? I saw him, like, spin around. Like in yeah. Mario Sunshine, you spin around. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, capturing the enemies. <laughs> wow, that's cool. That is cool. <laughs> I'll tell you what, the guy who did this has done a fantastic job. Yeah. He really has. <clears throat> I forgot his name, but he makes like lots of really good ones. Yeah, hacks. he does. Yeah, he's done loads. Oh, I've done Zelda think. ones, for instance. Oh, yeah, mm -hmm. Zelda Mario 64 and all that. Yep. First move. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't cool. send you back to the uh, uh, lobby or whatever, the ship. Right. Like in Mario 64, when you get a star, it sends you back to the yep. parcel. This is almost like uh, it should have been, you know, done by Nintendo as a sequel to Mario 64. <laughs> yeah. This is what it could have been. I don't know how to do, like, when you throw the cap and then jump on it. Hmm. <laughs> I guess that's the thing with being the first time you've ever played it. I have not played it, so I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, it's discovering it all, isn't it? Mm -hmm. What the guy's put into the game. Because normally in the original Mario Odyssey, you can throw it and then do a dive and you just jump off the cap. But whenever you uh, throw the cap, you just lose all your speed in the air. Yeah. Well, oh. That messed up. <laughs> I should have just done a normal jump. Yeah. Oh, I, can't, I can't get over it. It's, it's so cool. Mm hmm. <laughs> done like an N64 game, but... Oh, you can Mario do the Odyssey. thing from um, 3D World, I think, when you ground pound and then jump to oh, yeah. get an even higher jump. I should have long yeah. jumped. But I think that's from 3D World. Yeah. He's got all these different elements in there, isn't it? It's very, very clever. Mm -hmm. The way he's, he's managed to mix it all up like that with all the different elements in different Mario games. Yeah. Wait. Oh, I missed. I'm trying to get it to like spin on that thing like in Mario. Oh, yeah. so, oh I don't think you can. Uh, maybe you can't, yeah. Yeah, that's like I was saying earlier, so we finish over the limitations. Oh, this but... is back at the start. Alright, <laughs> <laughs> mm. how do I get onto that? that uh, uh, uh. Wait. Can I triple jump off of this? Hmm. <laughs> no. That was a side flip, but <laughs> I'm at the bottom now. Oh, I can just climb up instead. So it wasn't too bad. Oh. Looks pretty damn bloody good, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. It really does. Not really, really good. Oh, there's more platforming. Oh no. Oh, Captain Toad. <coughs> He's in the original. How funny is that? Captain Toad. 
Got another one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that three now? Two. 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 You've got to get one more. And then the game starts properly, mm -hmm. I think. Uh, there's something down there. I think that's one of the challenge things. Mm -hmm. I wonder if I can make it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 How am I supposed to get that? It's like, oh, it's one of the blocks. Ah, yeah. right. So there's a box. So you just got to go out there now. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's going to vanish in a minute. Too good. I'm going to go in it. Yeah, cool. No, oh, where do I go? I don't know. You know, you were supposed to get the first green mountains. You're supposed to go back to that ship, aren't you? But how can you? By pausing it and pressing exit. Uh, like in the original. There you go. <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah, now I can go to uh, what's it called? Yep. I'm going to jump off the edge. Mm. Oh, there we go. That's like a dinosaur world now. Right? Yeah, I forgot oh, what it's oh, yeah, called in uh, a dinosaur race. Yeah. yeah. I forgot what it's called in Odyssey though. Yeah. I'm getting out of fucking car. Mm -hmm. Listen to the music. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, and the coins are 3D, I didn't even realise until just now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I bet it's quite um, confusing in a way, because you think you're playing Mario Odyssey in some senses. No, I think I'm playing Mario 64 more, I keep forgetting about the cat. Oh dear, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you're going the other way, yeah. Mm. Mm. Can we get up there? There we go. I keep trying to punch instead of throw Cappy. It just shows you with the games he's done previously on this one, what he's mm -hmm. capable of is absolutely amazing. What is he going to bring in the future, do you know? Mm, I know he did do a 3D world hack with like the cat suit and all that. Did he? Yeah. <laughs> and I played that one, that was impressive. Yeah. Had all these new power ups and stuff. Yeah. Ooh, made it up. Yeah, for so long. The uh, diehard fans of Mario 64 wanted like a sequel <laughs> to that, you know. Uh, and the chainsaw. Mm. Right, where can I go to? Oh, I think you just run into them. Yeah, just run into them. Yeah. Star? Oh, that's uh, unusual. Oh god, the chain chomp's gonna get me. Oh, they do get me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, this is cool. Yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Well, look at that, he's got a cafe. Yeah, mm -hmm. That was a real nice move with that horse in it. You can actually throw him still. Yeah. yeah. It may not be identical, but it's still really cool. Yeah. No, he didn't triple jump! Oh, no. <laughs> All the way back at the bottom. Oh. I'm going somewhere else. Yep. Why did I... Oh my god, I'm still alive. I nearly fell off the edge. Because I did a long jump instead of a triple jump. I'm gonna double jump, that's good. Well, this is gonna be a stupid question, but do you like it? Um. Oh, it's 5G, yeah, I do like it. That's yeah. good. Yeah, I thought you would. Even though I can't do the cap jump thing. Yeah. Nope. But it's still good. Why didn't you grab onto it? Oh my gosh, I'm so bad at this game now. <laughs> As you can see, <laughs> I just want to get over to there. I haven't played Mario 64 in so long. I'm really bad now. Yeah, you did it. Not for me. There we go. Yeah. I don't think there's any fall damage. Because <clears throat> it doesn't seem to take any. Or it's like really increased. Yeah. 
Oh god, how do I do this? Oh god, no. <laughs> that was close. No, it's gonna fall on me. <laughs> you did it, you got fast, but... Yeah, but I didn't get the moon because I yeah. missed the platform. Yeah. I'll try one more time for that moon. Yeah. yeah, you can see the graphical glitches now and again, can't you? Yeah, but that's not yeah. like that big of a deal oh, considering yeah. everything else. Considering everything you get, yeah, yeah, that is absolutely nothing. It's not even like really bad, it's just mm -hmm. in the background. Yeah. <laughs> I just want to get over to the other side one more time. We can do it this time. Mm -hmm. oh, there's something over there. Hmm. Okay. No. Wait, what is that? Yeah, where is that? I think that might be where I started. Hmm. <laughs> well, I'm just going to try this again. Oh, I should have done it closer so I'd have more time. Oh well. He didn't, like, do the thing where he slides off the wall so he can, like, jump off it. <laughs> Oh, they have like the moon rock things. Hmm. There's like a uh, Mario Odyssey after you beat the game, all these like rocks come down, and if you hit them with Kathy, then it uh, puts more moons into the game. Yeah. It's like a challenge after you beat the game. Yeah. Who's this guy? Uh, oh, race. Like in Mario 64. Yeah, so you got that, that element as well. That's, yeah, that is well in front of you. How cheap is that? Mm hmm. That is not as simple as it is on Mario 64. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, you've got to follow him, haven't you? Yeah. First time, really, so you're going to like this no matter what. First time. And what a hard race it is compared to the original. I can't even get up onto the thing. Yeah. Well, at least yeah. you don't lose 10 coins when you die like in the original. Yeah. Yeah, well. What a cool thing it is. Mm -hmm. it's challenging, but I'm also bad. Yeah. yeah. We're sure you're going to uh, play it to death now. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, it. It's more just my Mario 64 skills in general. <laughs> Look, he did the spinny thing like I was talking about. Yeah. I don't know how I did that. I can't wall jump off that. Of course, Josh is using a PS4 controller for this, and obviously we're using an emulator. And this is not an official game. Um, so yeah, it could be down to uh, the different controllers that you might want to use. Obviously if you pick this uh, ROM up, and uh, you know, it depends on your emulator, your, your uh, controller that you're going to use. Because mm, I'm more used to the Xbox 360 controller and... Uh, oh, there we go. And um, the PC port, that's the one I played the most. Yeah. Here we go! Well, I suppose we better leave it there, aren't we? Because mm -hmm. we can always come back to it uh, another time once you've got more familiar with it and see what else mm -hmm. there is in this game. But this is a fantastic first look at this absolutely incredible. Yeah, Super Mario Odyssey. 64. Mm -hmm. How weird is that? Right, look at that. I'll be back with my final thoughts as Josh plays us out. I said it many times before, guys. The second vape is needed sometimes because sometimes something just blows your mind and that's exactly what that did to me guys as i said earlier i can't thank lady decade enough for this this, this i would never have known about it if it hadn't been for her so if you want to check out her video guys that's why i haven't talked too much about the developer or anything like that because she covers that and i feel you need to go over to her channel 
and watch her video because it goes so in depth. So, oh, so in depth, guys. So, yeah, I will link it below. So go over there and give that a flipping watch, guys. Um, it's awesome. What an awesome video. She goes deep, deep, deep into it all, including some of his other works that he's done, like with Zelda and what have you. So, yeah, you need to go over there and watch that. But, yeah, wow, that blew me away, guys. So beautifully done. Yeah, there's a few little graph graphic glitches in the background. There's bound to be, guys. There's bound to be. Um, obviously, like I said, I'm using a emulator to run that. And Josh was using a PS4 controller. So there might be better ways, you know, better controllers even, of uh, doing that. There might even be a better performing N64 emulator. But I think the one I'm we're using is pretty damn stellar. So I think it would be a hard act to follow. But oh my God. It's everything, really, that the diehard fan community or whatever of Mario 64 would have wanted from an N64 sequel. I know it's downgraded, guys, from, you know, the original Mario Odyssey, of course, and all that. Yeah, but oh, oh my God, what a fantastic project that was. Oh my God, it's beautiful. That is what it would have looked like on the N64, guys. He's done such a fantastic fantastic job i can't even begin to tell you we well, saw it with your own eyes this is freaking awesome guys so if you haven't got this yet get out there and grab it guys you can grab the rom quite easily off the internet use an n64 emulator and then use whatever controller you feel suits you best um but yeah certainly the the ps4 controller works very very well once you get used to the the buttons and how they're laid out and what have you but oh my god wow what can I say? Absolutely gorgeous. To have taken Mario 64 and mingled it. <laughs> Mario Odyssey. Oh, who would have believed it? All right, and with that, absolute and utter, yeah, shock and love. That's all I can say. I love it. I love that game. Um, yeah, I'm going to wrap things up, guys, and I'm going to say the usuals. If you're not subbed already, please drop me a sub. Give me a bummy thumbs up if you feel that way inclined. And of course, tap the bell icon and the all icon to get any future notifications whatsoever. And again, guys, like I was talking there about using an emulator. Do you love emulation? Do you like preserving these old classics, guys, for future generations to enjoy? Because if you do, emulation is definitely the way forward. That is a fantastic way of preserving these gems that would be lost otherwise. So yeah, I've got a fantastic group for you. If you do love emulation, it's the Retro Emulation Fan Group over on Facebook that me and my bestie Nate set up some time ago. We now have over 600 uh, members, guys. I nearly said subs. Members. Absolutely fantastic, that is. Absolutely. We, we're blown away by the amount of people who've come to us. It's incredible. And of course, we have stellar content video-wise. We have unboxings. We have reviews of systems. We have emulation performance videos and tech help videos as well. And a stellar admin team to help you with those tech issues. So yeah, if you just love emulation, guys, head over. It is linked below and come and join us. Then I also have my UK Crap Gaming Facebook group as well, where we cover everything from retro, you know, literally the dawn of gaming with Pong machines and what have you, right the way through to PS5s, whatever. You want it will be there guys so yeah again if you just absolutely love gaming you're set there guys we've got tons of videos because other youtubers put videos up every single day we've got still an admin team again and an ever-growing member base again as well we have plenty of people to banter with so yeah if you just love gaming guys head below here's a link there again guys head over ask to join and i'll accept you in no time with that I'm going to go and play that some more, guys. I'm going to say off Wiedersehen. Tschüss. And goodbye. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye-bye.